that camera and now the, the lost the uh, other night? Um, I mean, uh, we just need a win. I mean, we we had a good streak going before that uh, against some really good teams. We just came up short in Virginia. And uh, now we just need to uh, get back on track going into the tournament. Monday night notwithstanding, I mean, it did seem like you guys had really found another year mm -hmm. here in late in, back in the late February as far yeah. as now. But, you know, what was clicking so well? Um, I think we just bought in a little bit more on the defensive end. We tried to just understand that how we got to where we were last year and we played well defensively. We tried, we tried to do that. And uh, we didn't even play that bad of defense against Virginia, but at the same time, we didn't score the ball at all. But uh, we just needed to play a little bit better, and we just trying to hit our stride at the right time. You guys have only been out rebounded a couple of times this year. Duke did it at their place. What do you call when uh, wrong at night? Why they out rebounded you? And what do you guys have to do different Saturday to kind of flip the script? Um, just do what we do: attack the offensive glass and. Um, get stops to get boards and for our transition points, and uh, we just have to play our game. We can't overthink, overthink the game. We just go out there and play and do what we do. We say that before every game, do what we do, and uh, we can't hang on what happened last time because it's going to be a totally different game. We're going to have to figure out a way to win. You said the other night after the loss at UVA that you you went back to last year. You guys lost there and then kind of went on a run. Mm -hmm. Do you sense maybe that you guys are? And do the very same thing and you kind of have the mindset yeah. right now. I mean, that. it's just, it's a whole lot more relaxing. Well, not relaxing, but it's not as much stress as last year because we didn't, we weren't, nobody's been in that situation before where you can be outright champs if you win this game. So we, uh, we've we been there before. We know what it takes. It's going to be a grind the whole 40 minutes. So um, we're, we're ready for it. We're just going to get back to work today and see what we can do on Saturday. Was there any panic after that loss last year? And you're saying maybe there's none now? or what, um, what is it There wasn't panic, but it, we've never, like I said, we've never been there. So we like, we're going into the game sort of not blind, sort of blind to, to it. Um, the intensity of the game was crazy. So, because we, we wanted to ring so bad and we had everything in place, and we just had to win in, in camera indoors. So that's even harder. How does Luke Kennard different to prepare for this year? Uh, he's so much aggressive, and the confidence level he has. I mean, he's a, it's at an all-time high. Every time he shoots it, he thinks he's going down, and most of the time he does. So um, he's playing at a very high level. Yeah, you know, one thing I've noticed with Coach this year is whenever he's asked about somebody who did something really good. Mm -hmm. uh, he might throw a quick compliment out there, but then it's followed by critiques mm -hmm. and kind of, you know, well, so-and-so did something nice, but they should do more of this mm -hmm. too. Is he talked to you guys like that? Is, is he been on Oh, yeah, he just wants us to always get better. I mean, mm -hmm. he doesn't want everybody, anybody think somebody's the best thing walking. So uh, he just wants us all to get better at, at all the time, and um, he's just trying to challenge us. Is he doing that?